Welcome to Crafty Chemist Designs. Today I will be doing a walkthrough of the Close to My Heart May-June 2022 catalog. Let's get started. The catalog begins by telling you how you can become a maker. It also talks about our amazing VIP program where you can get 15% cash back. We also have a Craft with Heart scrapbooking subscription program and a Craft with Heart card making subscription program where you can get four month or 12 month periods where you get regularly sent either a scrapbooking kit or a card kit. The first collection in this catalog is called Fresh Paint. It is so funky and fun, fresh, colorful. I really love this design and it is great if you have active kids um, or a boy who likes a skateboard, girl who likes a skateboard. Let's look at the Fresh Paint paper pack and sticker sheet. You get six sheets, two each of three double-sided designs and one coordinating sticker sheet. Let me show you a close-up of the sticker sheet. Here we go. I have used a couple in my samples. Look at this paper. I love this paper. The hearts on this are so colorful and then the back side is like paint splotches with a spray spray paint can. This one I love the checkerboard kind of has a throwback to Vans shoes. This has got some nice graffiti print on it and this page has like an ombre capri blue color paint dripping. And isn't that a fun zip strip? And the back is an ombre yellow and orange kind of spray painted design. We also have the Fresh Paint Coordinating Cardstock. Close to my heart always curates a nice collection of coordinating cardstock to match the paper collection. And here is the bright colors in the Fresh Paint Coordinating Cardstock. You have black, white, nectarine, lemonade, capri, and candy apple. You get two sheets of each, and they are 12 by 12. The elements that go along with the Fresh Paint collection are called the Fresh Paint Acrylic Shapes. They're assorted black, blue, red, and white acrylic shapes. They vary in size from a quarter inch to two inches. And they're very thin. They're approximately one eighth of an inch thick. So they're thin enough that you could put on scrapbook pages or even put on cards that you send through the mail. No problem whatsoever. Then there is the Fresh Paint Digital Art Collection. You can cut a variety of shapes that coordinate with the Fresh Paint Paper Collection. There's a scrapbook layout and a single page scrapbook layout that um, you can make pre-designed uh, for you. And then lastly, um, we have the Fresh Paint Picture My Life cards. You get 24 double-sided pocket cards featuring unique designs and sentiments. 12 each of 4x6 and 3x4. Here's my sample that I made using the Fresh Paint collection. You can see I popped up the sticker sheet. I used a zip strip across the top and some of those acrylic shapes. I love the stickers and there's another acrylic shape. I popped up the rainbow. I wanted to show you um, that you can use this paper collection for anything. It doesn't have to be um, about you know skateboarding or painting. Although this is about um, my daughter moving, so they did do some painting. So I thought that the paper collection was perfect for it. Now let's look at some of the stamp sets. We have the Fresh Paint card making stamp set. You can get it either with or without the thin cuts. Look at that pizza. It says party like it's 1999. And then we have the Fresh Paint scrapbooking stamp set. You can get it either with or without the thin cuts. I love that dripping paint. Look at the layout that they created using that ombre yellow and orange paper. 
This is the Fresh Paint Scrapbooking Workshop. Here you get um, materials to make three coordinating 12 by 12 two-page layouts. And there are the three layouts that you can get. This is what you get in the workshop kit. You get one fresh paint paper pack and sticker sheet, six cardstock sheets, one candy apple, one bluebird, one clover, one lemonade, one nectarine, and one white daisy. You get three exclusive pattern paper sheets that are 12 by 12, three exclusive die cut sheets that are 12 by 12, two exclusive black paperboard die cuts, one set of exclusive acrylic shapes, and four top load 12 by 12 memory protectors if you choose to get that. This is the Fresh Paint card making workshop and isn't this fun? The retro cassette tape is driving me wild. I love it. You can use the materials in this kit to create 16 cards for each of four designs. I love the sayings, you're not old, you're retro, you're my jam, true love, and you can use those as the title of your cassette tape. Isn't that fun? In this kit, you get one exclusive V-size stamp set and coordinating thin cuts, two fresh paint pattern paper sheets, five cardstock sheets, one black shimmer trim, and 16 white cards and bases. The second collection in the catalog is Tutti Fruity. And this has got a beautiful sort of pastel look. The colors are flamingo, grape, capri, mint, lemonade, and white daisy. And there is a, like a popsicle, ice cream, and fruit sort of theme to it. I love the designs on these samples that they made. Look at those fun papers. Let's take a look at the paper sheets, uh, the paper pack. The Tutti Fruity paper pack and sticker sheet. You get six sheets, two each of the three double-sided designs and the one coordinating sticker sheet. You can get it with or without the sticker sheet. Let's take a look at these papers. I love the sticker sheet. I did use a few in my sample. You got this, um, these little sentiments at the top. I like that little melon piece. Here's a scoop, treat yourself, nice titles that you can use. And notice how these are UV coated, so you get a little bit of that shine on each of the stickers. Um, I love that little lace detail on strip there and some more of the sentiments. You've got some ice cream, you've got some fruit theme, you've got a sunglasses theme. Really cute. Look how fun that paper is. The first paper, you have this all over popsicle print with a cute zip strip with sunglasses. I love the colors on that. And on the reverse side, you have an all over print with fruit, like watermelon and the cantaloupe and so on. This paper has an all over sunglasses print. And on the reverse, it's like a yellow with very small print of the ice cream, the glasses, all of those icons. I love this paper. You've got the sort of like candy stripes, almost like an awning. And then this is a blue paper with uh, white dots on it. The coordinating cardstock, um, you get 12 sheets, two each of the white daisy, flamingo, grape, capri, mint, and lemonade. Close My Heart curates a beautiful set of coordinating cardstock to go with each of the collections. And look how nice um, these papers go together and go with the uh, printed papers. White Daisy, Flamingo, Grape, Capri, Mint, and Lemonade. I love that color combination. So fresh. It reminds me of Sorbet. Okay, and the elements for this um, collection are called the Tutti Fruity Mini Shapes. And they're loose assorted shapes in Capri, Flamingo, Grape, Lemonade, and Mint. They're five millimeters wide. And they have left, like a orange um, segments on it. Now these are not the 
tutti frutti ones these are from a different collection but i wanted to show you what they sort of felt like they're like little foam pieces they're very thin they did not have the uh, mini shapes in when i placed my order so but i wanted to give you an idea about what they were like now let's look at the tutti frutti digital art collection here you can cut a variety of shapes that coordinate with the tutti frutti paper collection and again, they have a pre-made scrapbook layout and um, some pre-made cards. I love the Dole Whip. If you're a Disney fan, you need that. But look at the fruits. Um, and then you have the Tutti Frutti Picture My Life cards, 24 double-sided pocket cards featuring unique designs, sentiments, and icons. You get 12 each of the 4x6 and 3x4. Not all designs are showed. Um, here's my sample that I made using the collection. And this is my granddaughter's first time in the swimming pool, so the Tutti Frutti collection was just in time for that. And I tried to use a layout that um, showed you all of the different papers. Look at the sunglasses, the popsicles. I love the little sunglass icons. You can see in some of the pictures she was wearing the sunglasses. It was so cute. The perfect day in Florida with the sunglasses and popsicles. And you can see all of the different prints. And even use some of the zip strips up at the top of the paper there. I popped up some of those um, stickers. Okay, now let's take a look at the Tutti Frutti card making stamp and thin cuts. How fun are these? You can get this either with or without the thin cuts. You get eight stamps. And I love the samples that they made. And then there's a Tutti Frutti scrapbooking stamp set. You can get it either with or without the thin cuts. The pictures in pink are the ones that come with the thin cut. Um, life is sweet. So much is happening. Hello, summer. Fun times. Look at that cute layout. I love it. This is the Tutti Frutti Scrapbooking Workshop. In this workshop, you get the materials to create free coordinating 12 by 12 two-page layouts. And here are the three sets of layouts that you can create. Look how pretty they are. And very different. They're very unique designs. This is the workshop kit. And in the workshop kit, you get one Tutti Frutti paper pack and sticker sheet. Six cardstock sheets, one Capri, two Flamingo, one Sage, two White Daisy, three exclusive pattern paper sheets, three exclusive die cut sheets, one exclusive Flamingo cardstock die cut sheet, one Tutti Frutti mini shapes, one clear acetate circles to make a shaker window, one double sided 3D foam tape and circle, and then you can get it with or without the page protectors. This is the Tutti Frutti card making workshop. And in this workshop, you get the materials to create 16 cards for each of those four designs shown. How fun are they? You have a big sort of wreath made out of the fruit and the ice cream and the sunglasses. I really love the um, flags that um, you can cut out. There's some different sizes. In the kit, you get one exclusive B size stamp and the coordinating thin cuts, three Tutti Frutti pa pattern paper sheets, five cardstock sheets, one silver glitter gems, and then the 16 white cards and envelopes. This is the mix in paper pack for the May June catalog. Our mix in papers are always created to coordinate with the two collections in the catalog. You get six sheets, only one each of the six double-sided designs. So if you want to do two-page layouts, make sure you get two packs of this. The first one was a sort of blue set. This is a flamingo set. I love that zip strip. It's a sort of uh, almost like a heartbeat design on that. It's not quite, but almost. Here is a flamingo with a white triangles. Here is a nectarine plaid. Uh, nectarine sort of diamond all over pattern. This one is a lemonade diagonal stripes. 
And I love that zip strip with the different color flowers. And then the back here is a lemonade um, and it has sort of waves on it, white waves. This one is a mink color with uh, blue X's on it. Nice zip strip there. And then the back is a mint color with sort of diamonds and dots on it. And then this one is a black background with white hearts and a fun uh, rainbow hearts on the uh, zip strip. And then this is a white with black uh, dots on it. Again, you only get, you have to choose a side. So you only get the six sheets. Okay, let's look at all of the my acrylic stamps that come in this one. The first one is a Front Porch Sip and Stamp and Thin Cut Set. You can get this either with or without the Thin Cuts. It's all about sweet tea, sip and lemonade. This, um, the top one is called the Palm Fronds Stamp and Thin Cuts. You can also get it with um, or without the Thin Cuts. This is great to make um, scrapbook uh, layouts or cards. And there's some really nice samples here in the catalog that shows you how to do that. You can stamp directly on the scrapbook page or you can die cut them to make um, cards. And then you have the brush strokes stamp set. This one does not come with thin cuts, but you can see how they're used. They're used to um, stamp sort of ink color behind these um, titles and the different sentiments. It just makes it stand out a little bit more. This uh, stamp set is called Summer Greetings. You can get it with or without the stamp set. A nice beach kind of design. Look at those cute samples that they made. And then this stamp set is called Beach Day Treasure Stamps. You can get it with or without the thin cuts. And this is perfect for your summer vacation. Look how cute that layout is. I love this next stamp set. I got it myself and it's very unique. This is called Birthday Number Stamp and Thin Cuts. Um, and you get those four stamps uh, with the mermaid, the knight, the pirate, and the princess. Um, but you can also get the birthday number thin cuts. And so it cuts out the, the little numbers. They're, they're small, they're one inch tall. And then um, you can get it either with or without the thin cuts the thin cuts by themselves or the stamps by themselves. So there's three different um, permutations. And here is a close-up look at the numbers. Again, they're about one inch tall. So really uh, make really fun cards, as you can see. I used it to make a shaker card with the princess, and you can see the one Isn't that super cute? I can see so many uses of it. This stamp set is called A Million Reasons. It does not come with thin cuts. Some really pretty sentiments that you can use on the front or the inside of um, cards. I love this stamp set and it really um, matches the fresh paint collection. This one is called Skate Like a Girl. It's about sort of roller derby. And look at those roller skates with the uh, wings on them. I love that layout. Love it. This one is called BMX Life Stamp and Thin Cut Set. Again, you can get it with or without the thin cuts. Look at how they matched up with the Fresh Paint um, collection papers. This is, I think, one of my favorite pages in the catalog. Um, the first one is called All Kinds of Awesome, and it's these uh, four stamps here. They're meant to go together and they sort of nest together. You can see that the, the top two um, go together and the bottom two go together. And you can use them with the postage frame thin cuts. Those are thin cuts that cut out those shapes and they have sort of that postage stamp edge. Really nice. And you can see how the top um, stamps fit inside of that square postage stamp frame. So here's the stamp sets, and again, the For You can fit into that, um, the, the images there, and then the You Are Awesome, um, all kinds of awesome go together. What's nice about them is that you can mix and match the colors. 
On this card, I use the, the biggest one of the postage uh, frames thin cuts. Here I use the square postage frame thin cuts and that you are all kinds of awesome stamp. Again, you can see I use two colors. I use the Harbor and Wildberry. And here's another one where I use Wildberry and uh, Mulberry and then use the Harbor square postage stamp frame. Aren't those cute? Endless possibilities. And then we have the Lovely Wishes stamp set. And these sentiments are amazing, and I love, love the, the fonts. They're so different. Kind of reminds me of like an Elizabethan font or something. And then the Academia Rose. This is just gorgeous. You've got the sort of faded newsprint in the back, and then the uh, rose on top. And look at how they uh, stamped it in black and then colored it in with pink to make it stand out. It is so amazing. Really gorgeous. Okay, this stamp set is called Coffee Helps, and you can get it with or without the thin cut. Today's mood brought to you by a coffee. Look at that cute layout. I can see so many possibilities. And then this one is so nice. It's called Irish Blessings. There's no thin cuts with this, but there's some nice sentiments that you really can put on either the outside or the inside of your cards, but it makes really nice inside sentiments. Um, someday when the pages of my life end, I know that you will be one of its most beautiful chapters. So cute. Though miles may they lie between us, we are never far apart, for friendship does not count the miles, the heart measures it. Aren't those cute sentiments? I can see sending a lot of cards to my friends with those. And I like how they use the postage frames thin cut on the inside of that stamp set, or that card. The first stamp set in the top left is called Sweet Pickings, and you can get it with or without the thin cuts. It's got the watermelon and the strawberries. It says, I love you very much. Um, and then you have the Thank You So Much stamp set. This is um, one stamp. It's about a three by three inch design. It says, thank you so much. This one is called Decorative Stencil, a Decorative Textures Background Thin Cut, and it is um, the size of a card front. And then this one is Stitched Spring Vines Background Thin Cuts. Again, that is the size of a card front. And you can see the samples um, on the page there on the right. Here is the Decorative Texture one that I have. And look at how it makes the card front so beautiful. I cut that out in white and then behind it um, I used avocado and you can see that it fits exactly on the card front so it's an A2 size four and a quarter by five and a half. I love how they combined the sweet picking stamp with that decorative textures and also with the stitched spring vine background. Now I love this collection. This is the National Scrapbooking Month special. It's called Hope and Kindness. And this color scheme is so beautiful. This is the Hope and Kindness paper pack and sticker sheet. You can get it with or without the sticker sheet. This is a special collection because you get 12 sheets to each of the six double-sided designs and then the coordinating card st or coordinating sticker sheet if you select that. And the designs on this set are so beautiful. Look at those florals. Really has a Laura Ashley vibe to me. I love this small sort of daisy print. This is pink with uh, a green ivy on it. Here you've got sort of a desert rose with a overall printed background. And then this one is the yellow Sundance the pat pattern background. This one has stripes. And this paper is unique. It's got some uh, kind of one inch, one and a half inch stripes there. This one is a beautiful, sort of a sneak peek of the new pine color. And then the back has got these um, little sort of pocket cards that you can cut out. And then this one with the harbor background and the uh, pink dots. And on the back of this one, you also have 
some of the four by six pocket cards that you can cut out. So you can choose what you want to use. Look at these stickers, how beautiful they are. I did use a couple on my samples that you'll see, but uh, they're very beautiful. And the florals are so nice. They're, they're very um, realistic looking. And then here's a, a close up of the sticker sheet. It's a um, 12 by 12 sticker sheet. Um, and then there's a special hope and kindness coordinating cardstock. Normally the coordinating cardstock is just solid. This one, um, this set has um, some texture to it. Look at this one, it's like a harbor with a, a brush strokes on it. And then on the back, it's more, um, I don't know, like galaxy print. This one is that uh, sneak pink pine color with this uh, brush strokes. Um, and then the back with the overall sort of splotches. Here you have the um, peach cardstock with sort of the splotches there and the brush strokes. Um, and then you have the uh, sage again with the brush strokes and the splotches. So nice. And then there are um, two sheets of uh, two designs with crafts. This one's craft with white stripes on it, and the back is just kind of a, a heathered look. And then this one is the craft with the white, um, sort of looks like it's been painted on a square. And then the back is the just the splotchy look. Um, the elements that go with this collection are die cuts. And what's special about this set is that they are 12 by 12 uh, die cut sheets. They're very, very thin. Let's take a close look at these. They've got overall beautiful designs, some hearts and florals. Um, and so it's made of craft sort of uh, cardstock. But look how thin they are. It's just slightly thicker than a normal piece of cardstock. So this definitely can go on scrapbook pages or cards without any worries about it. And again, it's a 12 by 12 size. Here's my sample that I made using that. That's that paper that has the stripes. I just cut it in half, cut it six inches. Use a couple of the stickers. Um, I did stamp on it with a stamp that you'll see coming up here. This is the Hope and Kindness Stamp and Thin Cut set. You can get it either with or without the thin cuts. It's got um, four big, beautiful uh, sentiments and then some little um, smaller sentiments on it. And you can see the ones with the green background have the thin cuts associated with it. I do have a sample that I made using that, using the paper pack, the stamps, um, and even that um, die cut. And you'll see what that doily comes from on the next page. Aren't these amazing? This is my pick of the catalog of your must-haves. This is the Fancy Border Thin Cuts. You get two dies, one that's uh, about two and a quarter, or two and three quarters, and one that's five and three quarters. They're so intricate and beautiful. That um, is the one that I use on the card. The other one, um, it's a little bit bigger for a card, but it does fit in your die cutting machine because it's less than the six inches. It will be beautiful on a scrapbook layout. Oh, you see there how I used it on my scrapbook layout. It makes just a nice little texture behind my um, pictures there. Okay, this is the May stamp of the month. It's called You Can Be Anything, and I love this stamp set. That mountain um, stamp is so beautiful. And it's got, you know, three titles, you know, friend, love, and peace. But it's also got some other little sentiments. And here's a sample that I made. This is a bridge card. I colored it in a little bit with uh, my tri-blend markers. Um, those are clouds that I cut out. And then that's the little um, trees that come with the set that's stamped right on it with um, New England Ivy. And then we have the 
June stamp of the month. These stamps of the month you can get for $5 with any $50 purchase on my website. Or if you're one of my VIPs, you actually get it for free with a $50 purchase. So here's the June one. It is called I Heart Summer. And it's got these really fun summer stamp strips. But I did something different. I cut my strips, at least one of them I cut um, into pieces so I can use um, my square um, thin cut borders. And then on the back is our Smile Big stamp set where $7 of the proceeds goes to Operation Smile. And there you have it, the May, June Close to My Heart catalog. I hope you enjoyed it. If you like anything, please go to my website at thecraftychemist.closetomyheart.com. Thank you.